Hi everyone, it's Doreen with Ooh La La Vintage Treasures and I am back to share with you a beautiful package that I received from Hildegard. I will put a link below to her YouTube channel. She doesn't do a lot of videos but she has done some videos and so I wanted to show her beautiful work you guys because I received this several like about a month or two ago. So I wanted to show you first what she sent me back in October and then I purchased this about a month ago. So let me go through everything because there's a lot to show. So get yourself a nice cup of coffee or your favorite beverage because it might be a long video you guys but I hope you guys are all doing well and I'm so happy to be doing another video for you guys and I will be doing some more. I got some more exciting projects to share with you and yeah so let's get started you guys. So this bundle of goodies right here is what Hildegard sent me. And so I'm going to move this out of the way for now. And I may have to come back and do a second part. So we will see how that goes. Give me one second. So I don't want to break my box. I'm putting it right here next to me, but it's on a shelf. Okay. So let me show you all these wonderful things that... Hildegard sent me, you guys. Let me first start with these gorgeous things. Oh my goodness, you guys. Check them out. Aren't they so sweet? Okay, so Hildegard is a master at everything. She knows how to make everything. She's made beautiful projects. And that's so sweet. And so she made me these, you guys. Oh my goodness. I got to try it on for you so you can see. Um, she knows how much I love cuffs because, yeah, who doesn't? And we haven't had a lot of cold weather. Um, but, oh my gosh, they're just so pretty. Aren't they just, oh, I'm only going to put one on you guys because it's, It'll be in the way, but isn't that just beautiful? Oh, I love her work. I wish I had the talent for this, you guys. It's just made with so much love and the ruffle. And I just love how the ruffle is. She made it in this really pretty little flouncy style. Hildegard, you are amazing. I love it so much. Oh my gosh, she blessed me so much at the time when I needed it. I wasn't even expecting it. And she told me a package was on the way. And I said, really? And she said, yes. And then it showed up at my door, you guys. Hildegard, these are gorgeous. Oh my gosh. Okay. So this one here, I love how she did this. And it's so simple to do. You guys take in one of those coffee filter. I mean... What are these called? Oh my goodness, I'm at a loss. You know what these are. Coffee wraps that go around your coffee cup. Probably laughing at me right now because I don't know what this is. It'll come to me if I steer it long enough. <laughs> okay, anyway. So there is what she put inside of here. Let's go inside and see. That is such a cute idea for a wrap and to give a gift. And I love, love this. Just the corrugated card, you know, I made a pocket out of it and stuck the, the things in there. Okay, let's see. Oh, this is so delicate, you guys. <gasps> Look at this. Oh my goodness. This is going to have to go on an inspiration board right here. I love collars, you guys. This is so pretty. Oh my goodness. It almost matches mine, my uh, bracelet. It's the same color almost. I love this muted pink. And then this is like a peachy collar. That is so pretty. Almost a blush pink. Isn't that gorgeous. And then she also sent me these two little cute plates. Little dishes, aren't those cute? Aren't they pretty? Pretty, pretty. I'm going to put those up here so they don't get broken. 
All right. Then look at this doily. So pretty. Okay, I'm just going to put this right here. And what else? Let me show you this. Look at how cute this is. <laughs> she took she took my digital. I have to see what digital this is. And she put it on one of those coffee wraps. Uh, what is this one? This is, oh, Snippets to Cherish Flower Shop, because it's got the 100 on there. That's so cute. I love this. It's so cute. So cute. It just shakes all over the place. Okay. All right. So, and then this beautiful doily. And I know what you want me to do with this, because she already cut on it. But look, you guys. Can you see that pattern? I love that little almost like a heart pattern but it's not a heart and then look at all these bottoms this little ruffle type of look so you can cut all these out and make lots of projects I think she wanted me to include this in a kit or something because she gave me a lot look at all this thank you Hildegard I love it it's so pretty and this makes a pretty flower too look at that so floppy I love it you guys, I've been in my craft room organizing my drawers. Did you guys see my video on my drawers? Hopefully you did because I found this amazing find on Marketplace. And, um, oh, look at this. Look at her bag. And I wanted to um, finish filling it up so I can show you guys the final result. Oh wow, look at how pretty that is. That's my Snippets to Cherish Flower Shop frames. And she made the stitched bag, it was so beautiful. I love that. Looks like she altered a some type of re recycled bag and it looks beautiful. Look at that. Isn't that just pretty? Love it. It's so pretty how she did the pink. See the pink edging she did right here on the bag? I'm not sure if she inked that or if it came with that pink on there. Did you make this bag out of something? I'm trying to see. It's something written in it like a water bottle. A water bottle bag or something. I love it. Okay, and inside this bag was the tag tucked into this pocket. Is this a... Oh, this is that hidden pocket Tammy did, I think. I'm not sure if anybody else did it. That is so cute. I didn't expect that to be a pocket. I thought it was ripped at first. I was about to stop the camera. <laughs> oh my goodness, that's so cute. Look, it goes like that and it says secrets. And then you can write on the back. I love this idea. I know Tammy made one at Embellish the Story and she decorated the top right here with some stuff. But I didn't expect it to do that. That's so cute. And the little pearls. I love it. And then this is her tag. So pretty. Your work is so, so pretty. Look at this. Oh, she sent me a note. Says thank you for my time and your team. Wish you and your family a Merry Christmas. Hugs, Natalie. Oh, that's so sweet. She goes by Hildegard. A lot of people call her Hildegard, but I've called her Natalie, and everybody calls her Hildegard. So, Hildegard, you'll have to let me know which one you like better to be called. I like both names, so it doesn't matter. But isn't that so pretty? She made a shaker tag out of the digital from Snippets to Cherish Flower Shop. That's so pretty. You guys, I've been wanting to get this thing filmed for a while. It's making me feel bad sitting in my craft room. I've had it in a basket over here. And, oh, look at this flower she made. She made that flower in this bag. i got to show you this bag. Look at this bag that she made. It has a clock. And look at the stitching. The tatting and the beautiful little roses that she made, did herself, and this is on fabric. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. Oh my goodness, and then all of these beautiful little doodads, all these 
pretty doodad things. A little sparkly heart. I love pearl hearts. And this little pearl with rhinestones. And Murano beads and pearls and pearls. This one has a little, like, a Cinderella. So cute. And this one has a heart and it says love. And some brown beads. And this brown piece, that's really pretty. I love that. I'm going to put this back in the bag here so I don't lose them. Lots of pretty bits to play with. And I think I got so excited I forgot to show you these bobbins. Those are adorable. I got some of these from Karina. And it didn't have the... This wasn't wound around it. But now I get it now. I get what they're supposed to look like. Isn't that gorgeous? And then she made this charm dangle. I like how... She added the turquoise with the pink. It looks so good together. So that's the tag. Oh my goodness. I love this. And a key. I love keys too. That is so pretty. And it's tied with this really soft trim. This uh, cottony kind of trim. Okay, there's that. That's the front cover. Well, let's go ahead and open it. There's so many things to look at. She did all of this hard work and I so appreciate her sending it to me. It came at the right time, Hildegard. It really did. It was such a, such a tough time for me back in October. Okay, I'm just gonna take this off and show you how pretty that is. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, I love it. And... I love this. I'm sorry. Silk in the prettiest pink. Okay, look at the inside of her cover. So she has this layer effect inside the window. And then she collaged around this with my digitals and stitched it. Amazing. Oh my gosh. This is just gorgeous. I feel like I need to be quiet and just show you <laughs> because I'm so excited to look at it. Oh my gosh. Hildegard, this is amazing. Look at that pink charm and the pearls. I just love all these little dangly bits right here. Oh, and the tatting underneath. It is so hard to part with tatting, you guys. If I give tatting away, you're not getting a big old piece like this because I don't have enough of it. <laughs> Because I love tatting so much. Okay, so here's the inside. And then she did this velvet right here in the pocket. And I think this might be another hidden. Yep, it's another hidden little spot. And she wrote notes. Oh my gosh, it's so cute with her own little lines. Isn't that so cute? Oh, that is adorable. Adorable. And she added tatting and a little rose. And this pretty cheesecloth. That is some different cheesecloth. It's very, um, I don't know, it just feels different. Different than what I get for cheesecloth. And that's the pattern in the back. Oh my gosh, that's so beautiful. I love the velvet too. The green velvet just really brings it out. And then here's this page right here. She put some pretty lace. On this page here love it and the lace on the side oh this is so sweet of you those are guard I love it oh my dress form isn't that gorgeous with these vintage frames I have to play with those yet and then another paper clip love it music paper she's got stuff tucked in all over the place here love that lace isn't that gorgeous in this page, I love these circles, how she put that on the, wall, the paper. I love doing that. And, oh, she stitched all the pages, too, you guys. Look at all the pages are stitched. Oh, that's so pretty. Look at that doily. She stamped on the doily. That's beautiful. Oh, some pretty ledger paper. And um, this page right here. 
all of this is my digital. This looks like special paper from a packaging. That's really nice. It's like a candy or truffle or something. Wow. Oh, I like this too. That's so cool. A little flip. And then this paper right here is really pretty. It's a really pretty paper. And let's see, we got a pocket here. That's so cute. It's like she altered a bunch of um, pockets from different things. Yeah, this looks like a like a pharmacy bag or something. Look at how cute. Okay, that's a good idea. I have some of these rings, big rings like that. That's cute. There's my uh, vintage frames. And this is all snippets to cherish flower shop. I love this. So cool to see my digitals in your work. Love, love it. And this is one of my favorite pages with the gloves. I love that page. And some more beautiful laces on her page here. Is this a tuck spot here? There's a little tuck spot there. So pretty. She stamped right there. Gorgeous beads. That is a gorgeous bead right there. Oh, that's a flower on the edge. That's cute. I definitely want to use this idea. That's so cute. I think I skipped some pages. Okay, here we go. So pretty. Oh, here's the middle. And she has these little danglies. And these are like a crystal. Kind of heavy-ish um, beads. Beautiful. Oh, I am so honored to have one of Hildegard's journals. Oh my goodness. This is so pretty. This pink it matches perfectly to my papers all these papers you put in here another paper clip look how big this paper clip is oh my goodness and this is an envelope it says a door I love how she did that she used her snipping scissors her pink pinking shears snip oh my gosh <laughs> pinking shears scissors try to say that a bunch of times and then inside is a little something in here. Just my little tuck spot there for um, one of my other kits she used in the Snippets to Cherish Flower Shop. I think it's the heart one. This is a little bouquet of flowers. The laces look so good on the edge. I love it. There's a little lady peeking in the corner there. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, I love this doily. This doily is amazing. You'll have to tell me how you colored that doily because it has something on it that makes it look this rustic look. It's gorgeous. This is so pretty. Oh my gosh. I'll definitely be looking this over and over again. Journals give me so many ideas when you see people's journals. There's a little, this is my favorite lady right here with her hat. She's just so prissy. <laughs> She's just got that way about her with her hand out. <laughs> I love her. That looks so pretty. Okay, and then that's cute how she did the bouquet word there. And then this is a tag with some pretty seam binding. A little flat seam binding. That looks good flat like that too. More laces. Oh my goodness, this is gorgeous. And I love the bird cage too and the flowers. This was a fun kit to design. And then she's kind of holding the flowers here in this image. She's got a little basket down here. 
So you guys, I just did a kit I just put on Etsy and it's a bunnies kit. And I was trying to think about doing a little basket and there's a basket I think in this kit. So I'll have to go see if I can find that basket and play with it with my, with my bunnies kit. Because I didn't um, have time to get a basket on there. This just feels like nostalgia right here with these images and her tatting is amazing. I love these. Oh my goodness. Tucked in this gorgeous pocket that she altered like an envelope. And put the digitals and then cut with her pinking shears and then stitched right here. Made a little window pocket on the page that is adorable. And this is like a really pretty marbly paper. It's like texture paper but it's really a cool texture. So pretty. Hopefully I won't have to do a part two. Man, this is so, so pretty. And this paper is very vintage old. You can tell by feeling it. It has that rag paper feel, which I love. And I don't know if the date's on it. It might be on the other side and I was pushing too fast to try to do this. So pretty. Love that paper. Love it. And I love how she did the stitching on the edges with the lace. Amazing. Blooms, how cute. I like how you did that. And the little pocket with the lace. Music paper. And then there's a little belly band here with this. Oh, that's so pretty with the word beauty and I love the layering you did on this. She stitched around it with beauty. One of my words in the kit. So this is my um this is my tag pocket and there's about I think 10 of them. So this is from Snippets to Cherish Flower Shop. I'll try to put a link to what these are but um if you look it up you'll see the shape is like a tag. And then you can fold the sides in like this. Or you could fold the, this side in and it makes a pocket. You know what I mean? When you fold it like this. So if you fold that tab in, there's all kinds of different things you can do with it. I was going to do a video on that. But I did show it on my Instagram. If you guys follow me on the Instagram, it's listed below. If you'd like to go follow me as well. And I did a quick little video on making this. Little, my version of it looks a little different than hers but so cute and then she used my um she used like a yellow or vanilla cardstock it looks so vintage it actually looks really pretty with that vanilla color i'll have to try that with this kit so that is that little pocket that's adorable hildegard i love it okay we're almost to the end you guys oh my goodness this is so pretty I love that. And then she has the lady with the bird cage. And this page again, I love that one. And the books. And then this tag right here. Another hidden one. <gasps> what did she put on this one? Notes. So cute. Oh my gosh, I have to make some of these. These are so cute. If I can put it back in there. I'm not sure the original maker of this. I think it's with uh, Scrapbooking With Me, I think, did this. I can't remember what Tammy said. Yeah. And that's the back. That's the side. <gasps> so pretty. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much, Hildegard. This was amazing for you to send me this beautiful rack of goodies random act of kindness I just love and appreciate you um, I've known Hildegard for so many years now it's it's wonderful and it was so sweet of her to send this to me I am so humble and grateful to you for sending this to me Hildegard I don't remember how we had this was this here I'll have to go back and look at the video see how to put it back where was this at I think it was tied in here. 
Uh, anyways, you guys, I hope that you enjoyed this part of the video. And I'm going to come back and do a second part because this one here is kind of long. I think it's about 30 minutes long. I might have to cut it back a little bit. I have more packages to share with you, but I'm going to come back and I'm going to do what I just showed you earlier. I'll be back to show you what I purchased from Hildegard. So stay tuned and I'll be right back, okay? Bye!